We are at the most powerful tech event in the world, CES. They are unveiling some of the craziest technology that you've never seen before. It's all new stuff. They're putting AI in pretty much everything. Has AI gone too far? Let's find out. Uh, I'm just getting started. Robots. Oro, your dog's perfect companion. You could literally leave this home if you want to yeah. go on a trip, and it will take care of your dog and play with your dog. It literally throws a ball, and it will feed it. And if I'm not mistaken, I think that you could watch your dog from, like, an app. Oh, yes. Yeah, the cameras. Yeah. Yo, an all-in-one solution. That's actually sick. Amazing AI. Straight out of a Black Mirror episode, bro. Those are cute. Thank you. 2XL is a talking AI robot. Fully conversational. You can ask him anything. You can talk to him about anything. Do you mold his personality by the way you speak to him? Um... Yeah, you can. I mean, he'll learn about you. He'll start to get interested in different subjects that you have. Uh, essentially like an AI best friend. Best friend. Kids, 5 to 12. Okay. And it's got all these guardrails, so they can't ask anything in the property. They're going to be on Amazon at the end of January. He speaks about 30 different languages. Little AI toy. First AI robot to get into mass market. Whoa. Wait, what was the retail again? $150. $150? That's not bad at all. Yo, I want one of these. It's really interesting. I mean, you can talk to him all day. He's just a cute look at his little smile, look! Wait, could, could we actually talk to it? Can you please tell me a story about a unicorn? Optimizing algorithms for real world applications. So he's gonna think for a minute. Once upon a time, in a magical forest, there lived a kind hearted unicorn called Sparkle. Sparkle would sprinkle glittering stardust wherever it went, bringing joy and happiness to all. What kind of adventures do you think Sparkle had in the enchanted forest? So it's so it's interactive. So it's an interactive story. So now you can tell him what you want to. <laughs> what do you guys think about AI? Personally, I wanted to take over the world. Yeah, absolutely. Like, if they had some robots here that were like police and like they like started like tripping out and like yeah. short circuiting for us and like we had to try to escape out of here, that'd be that's sick. A, that's I real just real. want oh. I robot. Yeah, there like, we right go. Coming <laughs> here. Yeah, I want that to happen. And I just have a robot set up. Yo, you know they actually have that. They oh, have really? that. Is they it? have a robot here that cooks a steak perfectly with AI. Oh, wait, that's over here somewhere. I just saw, I, I was sure I could smell it. Yeah. What is going on? AI is taking over the world. Yeah, yeah, it's it's cool. it's I don't know if I want to cook in my food because it might put some shit in it. It's even weirder if it's yeah, printing, when it's the, printing food. the food. Yeah, that is uh, true. That well, is very true. How do you just print food? Yeah, I don't know, bro. <laughs> I don't know. Science. The little AI friend. Moxie AI. Moxie AI. Dude, it's literally Black but Mirror. I think this one actually talks. I'm ready for Black Mirror to be real life. The future is now. AI I pool cleaner. Found artificial intelligence itself. It's right there in that ship. AI mirror. AI coffee brewer. AI lawnmower. Bro. Not only does it react to what you're playing or watching, but we actually have intelligence built into it. So now I think we're up to 13 games. Warzone, Apex, Fortnite, anything you play. It actually knows what's going on in the game. So if you die or use a special item, a special lighting effect plays. So you can have any of these lights. You can tell them, hey, do what the PC light does. Full room reacting. As a gaming streamer myself, if I'm in the game, and then boom, I die, everything just goes red. The next level, immersive experience. Like everyone's talking about AI, the ability in the app where you can literally say, hey, make me an LA Lakers design and it will actually do LA Lakers oh. colors or Barbie dream house, whatever you want. Even something like this or a curtain light, you'll be able to tell it, I want a cat dunking the basketball and actually build that for you. Just another Insane. way so you can quickly build the type of lighting effects you want. I feel like the best one overall would have to be the Mona Lisa eating a slice of pizza on their wall. Once it goes Bro. <laughs> that would be so look, it knows someone's shooting a gun from the sound, from the sight. See, it knows when there's lightning on screen. Oh, there's the firework. Oh my. AI wow. Your house. I want one now. Ice cream robot? Autonomous restaurant? Hey, yo. Holograms? Bro. The world's first 4K wireless transparent TV. You can see right through it. Oh, it's coming toward me. Oh, the other side looks way better. Holy wow. Oh. Augmented reality windshield. Hey, yo. <laughs> yo. <laughs> World's first AI chair. Oh. It's like a giant futuristic tank. Hello? That looks crazy. Apparently it's a future excavator? The Notice autonomous the detail mining. segmented on the tractor, uh, or the excavator. Those are actually uh, quite useful for the mining domain. Sony autonomous car. Robot walking around CES. Bro. 
100% electricity. It has zero carbon emission. Actual use in 2027 from Seoul to Incheon in 30 minutes, okay. which is incredible. Yeah. Powered by Linmus AI. The weather's sunny, then there's going to be a lot of people going to the ocean, right? Yeah. The team is going to find the best route to go fastest way. Sure, so we got the world first immersive translation earbud here. We've actually incorporated the whole translation solution in the earbud itself. No need of any mobile phone. The way it works, if you put in your ears and you speak, it plays out from the case for the next person to hear what you are saying. So it's real time? Real time. As, and as the person speaks, it plays back into my ear so that I can hear you. And the cool thing I really like is the auto detection. So let's say if you're on the bar and someone is speaking, you know, who are talking around you, mm -hmm. you would, you can actually detect, the system will detect what they are saying and then translate it into your ears. You can do online, offline. And how many languages are 60 programs? plus. Yo, that's crazy. What? That's so cool. Look, that's me. Yeah, I'm a hologram. What? <laughs> robots on robots on robots are everywhere. They're taking over. They're taking over the restaurants. This is gonna be our new waiter. Thanks, LG. Life's good with robots. Robots. Is it another robot guy? Is everything AI? Am I AI? You might be AI. Oh, so you should be seeing the hologram in front of you. Whoa, hologram. It's so lightweight, it's so small. It's literally just like normal glasses. And it looks so real. Uh, that actually is a person. He is live. He's live right he now. Have a conversation. He's in Seattle. Oh, you can hear me? <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, he said yes. Oh my god. Oh, I literally was talking about you like you weren't here. He is. He is here. Even though he's in Seattle. The next level of communication. That's incredible, dude. You're clean, Tetris! Drones. Hey, yo. Go crazy, go stupid. Whoa, it's a bouncy ball, huh? Went from drone to bouncy ball in two seconds. What the hell? Oh my god. Bro, bro, bro! It went rogue, it went rogue, it went rogue. AI robot. Hey, what do the robots do? Oh, we made robots for restaurants, helping people at home, doing inventory, helping nurses at hospital, and we bring uh, artificial intelligence in it. That is so awesome to hear. AI for the future. Whoa, a robot dance partner. <laughs> That's so cool. What? Oh my god. Yo. Wow. Ah. Yeah, it's the mini ones. Hello, that's so cool. The autonomous security robot? That's me. It's watching me in infrared. That's super cool. Walmart has AI powered shopping? Okay. Bro. Drone delivery. Drone delivery. 30 minutes or less. What? Walmart innovating, bro. Yo, imagine. Drone drops off your package. Google booth, more creating. Hey, YouTube create. This year we're getting that play button, baby. We're going to Plaque City. We're going to Plaque City. Subscribe if you haven't already. Let's go. We're demoing YouTube Create. It's a brand new video editing app from YouTube. And it's really going to make creation easy, more accessible, and more simple for all creators. We're looking at audio cleanup. What that does is it's going to remove the background noise from the video so your voice sort of stands out crystal clear. And the app is listening to the song that you just chose and it's marking the beat of the song on the timeline. What? <laughs> Yo. That you always have complete creative control no matter what, but it's sort of giving you that visual guide and making it really easy to figure out where to place your yeah. That's awesome. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, this is great. all free too? Yeah, it's completely free. <laughs> oh, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll add that to the pitch next time. Yeah. Empowering creators. Magic oh, editor in Google yeah. Photos. Reimagine your photos with generative AI. Hey! Yes. Yo! Look guys, look guys, look guys, look guys. The androids are taking over the world. The AI is taking over the world. No! Will Smith was right. AI is coming. TCL is showcasing some XR technology. Extended reality. We're extending the display from the PS5 onto these tiny little glasses that are super light. Oh, baby. Did you see? Yo! Automatically is right in front of me, so it doesn't matter where I'm looking. I could be looking down. I could be laying in my bed playing PS5. Apparently the resolution on this thing is better than any other headset. Bro, it literally looks like I'm looking at like a high definition TV, like some 4K TV type stuff. Whoa, bro, that looks like a movie. Remember when I said it was like 4K? No, it's 6K per eye. What if we put AI in this guy? Then it would be game over. We wouldn't be able to tell what's human, what's not. The takeover. AR technology, we can try on backpacks from CES. The 
future of shopping. Cause you can do this virtually or in person to try on stuff without even having to try it on. Insane. Leaden AR has these new AR glasses. Look at how tiny these things are. Super, super compact. And if it can get in here, let's see if you can see it. Oh, you can. It's not the best view of it, but it looks pretty good. All of your phone notifications, directions on where to go. I need these glasses. DJ Mark. AI for all. Samsung. AI innovation highlight multi screen internet connectivity fridge. It is an AI fridge. It tracks what food is in there, how much of it is there. So you never gotta wonder what's in my fridge. You can just check your app. So you can connect it with your stove, your cooktop, ring doorbell, and even laundry as well. That you can receive notifications across that. Camera right here is recognizing those products. And from here, it tells you what you have. And from here, it even tells you what, your, what the expected expiration date is. So that way you know. All right, I have an avocado and beef expiring today. Well, let's do this. That's incredible. Let's go there. I don't want to waste food, so I'm going to choose my avocado and beef. I'm going to search for recipes. Oh, this looks good. So we'll tap on that, and it tells you prep time, cook time, calories, Yo. and everything that you need. Wow. And then obviously the step-by-step. -step. All right, let's take it one step further. All right, you don't have banana shallots. So what we're going to do now is we're going to send it to a shopping list, so you can then buy it. Amazon Essentials uh, account that you're going to have connected, you can buy it within two hours hours that product will be delivered to your door. Convenience at its finest. <laughs> wow, what an incredible use of AI technology. Yep. In a fridge, smart home, the future is now. Thank you, Samsung. Yeah. This is awesome. AI washing machine? Literally, everything's AI. Let me just take a call real quick. Oh, oh, you're at my door? Oh, thanks for the package, bro. Yo, yeah, AI. Yeah, you can figure out how to watch it. I, I don't know the good settings. AI auto game mode. Samsung has created this 3D gaming experience without glasses. I'm talking the monitor itself has the 3D stuff built in. 3D gaming. Yo, so it looks trippy on camera. You can notice it with the camera, but trust me, the character is popping out of the screen right now. I don't know how this monitor is doing that, but that is impressive. The future of gaming, people. Right, that's a tech technology. <laughs> that's a technology. Right? I was like, man, where's the technology part? I need a glass to fill it, but then. No, nope. no glasses. You don't need it. <laughs> Check this out. Come on, kill this lady. Come on, you wanna fight me? Oh, she's not wearing it. Yeah. Sorry, lady. You need a shirt? Okay. <laughs> so apparently this is a prototype. We don't have an official release date, and we don't have a retail price. But this is the future. Autonomous driving, it's coming, people. Giant robot, hello? That thing's taller than me. Bro, the thing we've all been waiting for all these years, the flying car. And we have another one that's come out, flying car. This one will be taking pre-orders at the end of this year in China. This is the driving, driving mode. mode? Yes, and this flying. is Yo! <laughs> so you only need to use a joystick to control the flight. Joystick. What? Yeah. A joystick? Yes. Bro, you use a joystick to control your flying car? Yo, video games are real. And then where do you land? If I'm flying and I'm mm -hmm. going somewhere, and I'm like, all right, I'm at Walmart. Uh, <laughs> where do I land? <laughs> well, that is more like a long-term thing. Yeah, it's cool. In the shop you cannot be just like door to door, except like go to work directly with the flying car. That's the same. It takes time. So in the short term, might we have some conditions applied? It has to be some conditions. So you have to land on that roof or land on the skyscraper? I can only land on the, the helipad. It's like maybe some specific area just for flying cars. That's sick. That's insane. Flying car has arrived. Oh, it's about to take off. Half helicopter, half car. Dude, just look at the inside, bro. Dude, it literally looks insane in there. Hello? You literally control it with a joystick. It's transforming. The wings are going away. That's fire. Yo, that looks so sleek. Dude, that's gonna be wild. Bro, we're living in the Jetsons. Real life Jetsons, seriously, like. Yeah. The fuel man at CES. Doing deep fuel things with my deep fuel in my hand. Come on, new year, new me. I have become the can. I am deep fuel. It is a hundred years of CES. He's the G fuel man. He's the G fuel man. I am what I drink. I'm gonna be in all the stores. You're all gonna see. You're all gonna rule the day. Deep fuel man. I'm the deep fuel man. Chilling at CES with my deep fuel can. Use code Merc, baby. Yo, a delivery vehicle. Autonomous delivery vehicle. Yo, who ordered the pizza? Did you order the pizza? I didn't order the pizza. Yo, is it gonna stop holding. on him? Is it gonna stop? Oh, it went around, it went around. <laughs> they even put AI in toilets. 
Okay, maybe they didn't do that. That was a lie. I just blatantly lied to you. They didn't put any AI in the toilet. But imagine though, AI in everything. This is it. We're going home. It's not that far because I live in Vegas, so it's pretty convenient. But what do you think? Has AI gone too far? I don't think so. I think it has a little bit more to go. There's definitely going to be a lot of awesome use cases of AI in the future, and I'm very excited to see what next year has to show off because, hey, we might be even closer to that AI robot. Will Smith, I'm coming for you. AI is going to take over the world. One day there's going to be an AI of me, and it's going to take over the YouTube channel. Nah, nah, nah. I'm not Crumble Cup. Don't worry, Merc. I won't take over the channel. I'm just a happy assistant for now. Uh, subscribe to see more of The Orange Man. I'm watching you. Click the button. Do it now.